everyone, how are you? It is me, Jennifer Montgomery, artist, empath, light worker, spiritual leader. I'm in my car again, driving as usual, um, taking a family vacation with my dog and other family members are meeting us in Georgia and I'm so excited. So I always get a lot of insight and spiritual downloads when I'm driving or in motion or out in nature and my um, most recent insight or just wisdom, words of wisdom that I would like to share are about letting go to receive. So, you know, I fully believe that the universe has my back in all ways and I have to do my part as well so I can live my most best abundant life with all good things and sometimes that requires letting go of things, people, thoughts, perceptions, etc. that are not serving me. And sometimes that can be a challenge. Um, I can be a bit of a procrastinator sometimes. I always get things done, but it's more of a, I can go through some mental gymnastics on the way, which kind of slow me down a little bit because I'm always discerning and sifting and sorting. But um, I have discovered that when I let go of what is not serving me energetically or what is not resonating with me any longer, that the universe always provides me with something better um, and more aligned with who I am in that moment. It's really just up to me to take the action steps to receive it. So my most recent um, uh, situation with letting go to receive goes around my car. So I'm a little car bougie. I like, I love Lexuses. And um, so I've been driving Lexuses for, gosh, like 15 years now. I love them. And my last one, loved it. I love that car. And there was literally nothing wrong with that car. Like it was a beautiful car. I really liked it, but I was just had about, I had a nudge. Like I wanted a new one. Not, it was a necessity. It was a want. <laughs> I wanted a new car. And I would try to justify it by like, oh, you don't need this right now. I went to my mechanic asking him like, is this car in good working order? How many more miles do you think I could get out of this? And he's like, oh, you're great. You have like 100, 125 more thousand miles to get on this car. I'm like, okay. So that, that stalled me into staying in that, you know, keeping that car. But then one day I just, I couldn't, I couldn't resist that urge anymore. And I'm like, I really just want a new car. So I had made an appointment to go test drive a, um, a different a different model of Lexus and I absolutely loved it and I had no problem letting go of the other one is my point because I was resonating on the frequency of the newer car which I'm driving now so when you let go of things there's oh the universe is going to replace with better of course if you're if you're following your intuition and making healthy choices I can't say if you're if you're making stupid choices and you're gonna get you're gonna get stupid results but we're not gonna go there we're gonna talk about alignment and doing things um, following your intuition so I let go of the other car and I'm happy I'm happy with you know what I received I'm happy that I followed my guidance because the universe was letting me know it was time it was time for me to upgrade the person that I was six years ago when I bought the other car is different than who I am now I've grown I've evolved my lifestyle is different my life is completely different so those are important things to pay attention to in growth is that if we want to grow we have to we have to give it room and we have to let go of the things that are like weighing us down so for instance it could you know it could be a mindset it could be um you know like you can't expand if you're if you have all kinds of things like you know hunkering you down it's like you know moving from a place where say you have like a lot of stuff and but you want to you want to go into something else well clear the stuff let it go let all that other stuff go and then what will come in you know in replacement will be something that's far better and feels much better and is more aligned with who you are now and that could go for a relationship it could go for a location it could go for a job it's it's you know it fits in all different aspects of our lives but sometimes we fear sometimes we get caught up in routine sometimes we're lazy there's all kinds of reasons why we don't Speed do it ahead but on I can assure you every time I've actually taken the plunge and done it I've always feel better because the universe has got my back so those are my words of wisdom for today y'all I am 
driving to Georgia with my amazing dog to meet family for a much needed and anticipated family vacation. So thank you for listening. You can find me on social media on both Facebook and Instagram at Jennifer Montgomery Artist and also on my website at jennifermontgomery.net where you'll see my art of all kinds. And that's it. So until now, next time, have an awesome day and take